Today in managerial accounting, we're going to look at the break-even point and target profit. This is also called cost volume profit analysis. Companies want to know what are the sales necessary to break even and what are the sales necessary to make a desired profit. Let's start with what are the sales necessary to break even. The break even point is the level of operations at which a company's revenues and expenses are equal. The company will report neither an operating income nor operating loss. This is where our revenues equal our costs. The break even point can be expressed in two different ways. One is units and the other is dollars. The break even point in sales units is determined by taking fixed costs divided by unit contribution margin. The break even point in sales dollars is determined by taking fixed costs divided by contribution margin ratio. Let's look at an example. Level Up Gaming would like to know the sales needed to break even this year for operations. The expected total fixed cost will be $27,000 for 15,000 units. The company expects to sell the units for $10 and incur a variable cost of $4. Let's start with the break even point in sales units. We will take fixed costs divided by unit contribution margin. This is $27,000 divided by six. We get the six by taking the $10 in sales price minus $4 in variable costs. So 27,000 divided by six comes out to 4,500 units to break even. Now let's look at the break even point in sales dollars. We determine this by taking fixed costs divided by contribution margin ratio. This will be $27,000 divided by 60%. We get the 60% by taking the contribution margin divided by sales price. So this will be $6 divided by $10 to get 60%. 60% can also be shown as 0.6. So we'll take $27,000 divided by 0.6 to get $45,000 to break even. So what are the sales necessary to make a desired profit? This is where target profit comes into play. Target profit is the sales needed to exceed the cost to make a profit. This can be expressed in units or dollars. The target profit in sales units is determined by taking target profit plus fixed costs divided by unit contribution margin. The target profit in sales dollars is determined by taking target profit plus fixed costs divided by contribution margin ratio. Level Up Gaming would like to know the sales needed this time to make a profit this year for operations. The expected total fixed costs remain the same at $27,000 for 15,000 units. The company expects to continue to sell the units for $10 and incur a variable cost of $4. Let's start with target profit in sales units. We'll take target profit plus fixed costs divided by unit contribution margin. So 30,000 plus 27,000 divided by six comes out to 9,500 units needed to be sold in order to make the target profit. Now we can look at the target profit in terms of sales dollars. We'll take target profit plus fixed costs divided by contribution margin ratio. So 30,000 plus 27,000 divided by 0.6. This comes out to 95,000 sales dollars needed to make the target profit. 